We have all this green slime on top of the water here. I don't know how deep this goes. So what I'm going to do is bring my scuba tank down to the bottom of this pond here. Let a little bit of air out of the scuba tank. It should shoot up air to the top of the surface. And all the bubbles should separate all the petals away and create a nice little hole for the sunlight to come through so I can see what I'm doing. So I'm going to dive over here in this green stuff. Turn on my scuba tank and it should open up a big hole. I have my giant fins on. I have my scuba tank. I'm ready to do this. A little nervous, but... I think we're going to be fine. The water's pretty clear. It just looks like I just got to separate all this stuff over here. <laughs> this is crazy, man. It looks like I'm going into a swamp. Wow. What I think it just drops off deep right here, dude. The water's like crystal clear blue. As I look down there, it's crystal clear. You know, at first glance, it looks like we're in the middle of a swamp, but this is like a hidden treasure, man. Like, this is so beautiful. I haven't looked everywhere, but I don't see any alligators. We should be fine. Let's do this. Alright guys, I got like green stuff all over me, man. So I have my air tank at the bottom of the pond. It's letting out a little bit of air and it's kind of making a hole in this slime right here. It's allowing sunlight to go through so we can have better lighting. And I can show you guys what this place looks like from underneath. You know, at first glance, it doesn't look like this little pond is super deep. You know, it has this like green slime over it. Just looks like a swamp pond. But right when you go underneath, you notice a giant cave. And this cave, like to the entrance, is at least 40 feet deep. It's been a while since I've dove this deep. But with these huge fins, it should allow me to reach the bottom. And I'm super excited to see what's down here, man. That was so much fun, man. That was so beautiful. At first, when you looked at this, 
it looked like a swamp but right when you go underneath all the green super clear had a giant cave down there and it was just so beautiful man really breathtaking and that scuba tank idea actually worked really good look at this we have a giant hole right here in the middle of all the green it took a second but we finally got the green all moved over i wonder how many other spots look like this that look like a swamp but have something beautiful underneath but right now i have a couple more things i want to do there's a cliff right here i definitely want to jump off of that wow you can see all the way to the bottom from up here there's a giant tree right here i definitely don't want to hit that but that is just crazy all right i'm not gonna do any flips i don't want to like land on my back but i will just jump off this thing it's cool though you can see everything from up here i definitely got to show you guys this in a second all right, here we go. See you later, dude. Woo! <laughs> wow, that was so much fun, man. Hold your breath with me, and in the comments below, let me know if you made it to the bottom of the cave and back up, just like I did. Here we go, guys. This is gonna be crazy. crazy oh man I made it through another tunnel beautiful trees everywhere that was insane man wow that was so beautiful hope you guys enjoyed this video I had a ton of fun exploring this spot like I said like at first glance this looks like a little pond like a swamp pond but you know right when you go underneath the water it's just so beautiful man like you would not think like this was here like this is like a hidden jewel if you guys are new like i said make sure you guys subscribe we're gonna be doing some crazy stuff this year and i want you guys to be sure to like tune in and watch and join me on my adventures i love this kind of stuff man and i hope you guys are enjoying these videos as well and if you guys enjoyed this one make sure you guys leave it a big thumbs up i always appreciate your guys support it means the world to me and i wouldn't be able to do this stuff without it so thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys next time <laughs> i'm all greg <laughs>